and welcome back to another Plants vs Zombies 2 video. Today, as you can see, I may be doing... Oh, I may be doing some Plants vs Zombies PvP. So... <laughs> yeah. Hi! Um, I actually forgot that I had this on my PC. So I never really play the plants. The only people that I actually played was like Chomper, Colonel Corn, and like Sunflower sometimes. But I mean, PC, sir, I never really played I mean it was everyone's starter but it's something that I never did so <laughs> I found stupid I know but 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 I think that's true I'll do my I'm going to play some um, vampire uh, uh, today and um, for now I'm going to start to get some practice and just remembering how to do anything because I it's been a while since I played this well, this game in general and I can't remember how I did any of it I know that I did stuff like this a lot, but it is just annoying. Ooh, um, I can remember you can do this. Well, like. The good thing about being um, sunflower and being raised flag is you can heal like plants. It's really good actually. And if you like plant, you plant your plant next to another plant that you planted. So if you put plant your sunflower next to another plant, it would, you know, like heal it so then you would have something that would assist you in lots of ways and also it gives you good practice If you ever like, if it ever gets hurt, like the sunflower I'm talking about, um, like the plant, not the one I'm playing, but like this one, <laughs> um, if you ever, um, like, if it ever gets hurt, like the plant that it's, that it's healing can help it by killing the plant which really helps everyone. I'm going to go put that on my thing on there. And every time that you do the flag, it will really help if you do... I... Die, die, no, 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 no. Stop wiping me, stupid. I think I might get some friends and then we can all play. 
plan so this is zombies two together because i know a couple of people who have it and then i can share play it on my playstation with another one of my friends who knows how to play it just doesn't have it because they're not an avid enjoyer player Yeah, we're from my friend. Da, da. Mama. Um, no, 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 no. Why do I sound like Batman? No, 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 There's two. Yeah. There's more. I think, honestly, I think that the be the best role to play is attack and capture zombies, but. If you just if you just want to help your teammates, like you're a good person, play sunflower, but not vampire the sunflower because it can heal. But it's like in um, Team Fortress Two, the spy has is um, thingy that Tokyo knife. The dagger. Um, I forgot what it's called. But it's like, um, it takes on your HP, but you can like raise your HP. Also, I might do some videos on PC games because I I really enjoy them, but I can't figure out how to get it set up. Also, in um, in like a room next to mine that I'm doing my work in, um, it they, that's like where I'm gonna set up a gaming room. And I think my quality, the quality of my content will improve by a lot because nearly every game that you can, that you get on PS. No, actually, every game that you get on like any any console, you can either emulate um, those exclusive games, exclusive games, or you can um, or you can just buy them. Like I um, I know by my VR headset. Um, bone work. You can't. No, not bone work. Bone lab. Um, no, you can't emulate that on anything else because it's VR game. But you can emulate things off of um, like off of. I guess Steam. Like you can emulate bone works and. Different games onto a VR headset. I don't know much about it, but all I know is something about that. So I think someone's dead. I can't tell who they Oh, no one's dead. Sure. That. No one, no one, no one, I'm not British. Probably everyone who actually watches my videos knows that, but like, if you couldn't tell, I'm British. I'm like that, I'm like that funny, that funny British man. Funny brown British man. 
you know the one. Uh, Tommy in it. And also, to every American who watches this, or any, like, any other person that that's from another country who sees us, yes, we do drink lots of tea to get that stereotype out of the way. But it only goes for few, for some people. Like some people don't like tea, and then the rest aren't weirdos. Um, now I'm gonna be honest. I know like seven people who don't like tea. But that's just because I have weird friends. I'm not quirky weird, but yeah. Not many people like it. Also, please stop us. Please stop going. Oh yeah, I'll, I'll stick my teeth and I'll stop if you think you Also, we don't enjoy those stereotypes. If we're not, like, funny, but... Um, you, you, you can only enjoy a good stereotype if... It's by someone who has good intentions. Not like that, um weird group that um, start, that has three letters in it in its name and it's like um it's like the eleventh letter of the alphabet three times in a row. Not like those stereotypes. Because they're bad. But um like the good ones. Well it's like just good fun. No intent no mean intention involved. I mean other Brits do so Brits about saying, oh yeah, some more fancy, good eye bro, governor when or not but like I said that's all in good fun and I'm, I'm generally I don't like stereotypes I guess I'm else. like I don't like people asking me for help asking help asking me if I want help like that it's a weird weird trigger but really just get some of those. Load! Oh. oh, what the hell? Why? Here, here, here. <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna stop rambling on about, like, stuff like that and just enjoy the game because I, I don't really like people say that I don't enjoy life to the fullest people say that I'm not very depressed either just it hurts my butt but, but, but Sometimes it's just so of the form, sometimes it's to insult me. Either way, I either insult them back. Because it's all in good form. Sometimes. If it's not in good form, I don't know what happened, but... Usually it's in good form because I have friends who don't aren't mean to me. Oh no, go away. Go away. Die, die. <laughs> I 
Someone just killed me plants. Oh wait. Are they all dead? Oh god, they're all dead. Uh, oh, for some reason, like the beat when it impacts reminds me of it's the weirdest thing. But <laughs> rap god. So this is only a little more than another rap. Like, it reminds me of that, for some stupid reason. And I don't know why, it's just so, it's just... Yeah. Um, I'm gonna get on with the game. All the game time. Oh, what the hell? No, 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 no. Rapist Jesse. Rapist Jesse. Bye, Rapist Jesse. Uh, no. no. I don't want to go with your van. No. Stop chasing me. Oh, God. I do need reinforcements. Did you know? Awesome. Yes, kind of gone. Oh no! Oh no! Oh, yeah. Also, I hate the thing. screen. Screen. It is really annoying. The, and a good thing about the vampire flower is when you're facing bosses, it, it siphons for how much damage you're dealing. So stuff like that, when that happens, it, it actually helps you. In a way. Give me all these. Here we go. Here we go. In this attack! Okay, it's now it's just a normal stop. But a really good thing about this is um, another good thing about boss leaves is the the siphon that it gives is amazing. I just realised it's exactly like the um thing you know, but I it gives less HP but when you when you kill someone it actually it gives you more health and then it lowers over time. How did I I never know that or realize it at least? It 
not. Oh no, that's bad because it knocks you out of the thing. Not the only thing that I wish they added to um, Dungeons and Zombies is melee. Because melee is really, it would really help. Like just being able to hit them for that last hit when you're reloading. And honestly, I would love something like that. Because then it might actually be so I'm very focused. Wow. I'm gonna go play this now. doesn't really make sense. Like, why would you want to be mean to other people for no reason? There's really no self game. Yeah. I don't know why I'm trying to be for us. Not really anything that anyone can do. Like, you can't actually do anything about it. You just feel powerless. No one really there to help you. You just feel lonely. It's like when you're floating on water. But you can't feel your body. All you can feel is your mind. Slowly thinking about why anything really has happened. Like, why would anything do? something. You're just like, you're just pondering. It's like you have ADHD. Oh, oh what the hell. Hold on, is this? Oh my god, it's a hat. Try this out and see if it's good. Now this got a leaf attack, which I like. And then like the only thing that I want to know about it is you know, it looks like you can see through things. Uh, 
polite backhanded people. Hold on, you come back in. No, I never actually said things like this to people. Sometimes I just love my emotions and to me. I feel like it's a safe place. I mean, I'm in my bedroom. Nice, beautiful place. And I just, it's nice. But once you actually get into things, you just wonder if you can all succeed in anything, really. Am I going to do this? Am I going to do that? It's annoying, but... I... I'm sorry if this isn't the kind of a chicken here. And I get that, because sometimes I can be a lot more sad. A lot of people. And I, I make people feel down. I don't mean to be a bummer, but I sometimes I just want to put my emotions out and things like this. The, the things I'm passionate about, and this, this career is something that I'm, I'm passionate about, and it just greatly hurts me internally, thinking because I guess I, I enjoy this almost so much and I never want to let this thing go mm -hmm. I just yeah I feel really out of things and then the others I feel um, this. I don't like it. And then I do things like this. Because that out is is more enjoyable than anything I really want to do. It's been like, it's like coconut. Okay, that's a horrible example. It's like favorite TV show for a lot of people. And this TV show is from 2016. I used to watch it and I was like, I want to be on that. I feel like all, but I never thought of it. I don't think I will, but it's just I feel so much in denial. But in the same moment, I feel so alive in all of this. Really. When you want to be Thank you. I hope you pass for a long journey. Oh, I'm sorry that I promised that we would do the multiplayer route, but I cannot. This has gone on for a long time. And I just want to do the hide and seek thing. And then I will just say goodbye. Because I'm going to find Heidi's friend and play some hide and seek. Now, I don't know about you, but I love hide and seek. 
a lovely game and I want to play it with loads of people. Like, I want to be, like, do you know the, those videos of people, like, cute child YouTubers, um, who do, like, super hide and seek, and stuff like that. I want to do, like, fun stuff that everyone will enjoy. Everyone. Even Hardy. No. Um. Oh wait, I found Hardy's phone. Okay. Alright. Oh, I did anything. I just want to fuck with Hardy's phone. <laughs> I wish that he went to hide the tank, just sat there for a minute and then exploded. Um, okay. Anyway, so I think that we're nearing the end of the video. And I think, think, think we just go out on a bang. So, I am going to go out on a bang. Kaboom. <laughs>